Welcome to Insightful Gaming. In this video, we'll be discussing the best exotic armor pieces for Titans, which will synergize the best with the Strand subclass. With Strand's unique abilities, it's important to select the right exotic armor pieces that synergize well to create a powerful and effective build. We'll be covering some great options for Titans, including the Heart of Inmost Light, the Armamentarium, the Crest of Alpha Lupi, the Mask of the Quiet One, and more. Keep watching to learn more about these exotic armor pieces and how they can enhance your Strand subclass build. I had a lot of fun putting together this video. It's great to mix things up from my usual build videos and dive into the world of exotic armors and weapons. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please be sure to leave a comment below and let me know what you think. I'm always looking for feedback on how I can improve my content and make it even more entertaining for you all. Now let's jump straight into it. Let's talk about the first exotic for Titans, the Heart of Inmost Light. This chess piece is a game changer for any Titan using it on Arc or Void subclass, but now it will also synergize well with the Strand subclass. First off, the Heart of Inmost Light is all about empowering your abilities. When you use your melee, grenade, or barricade, you'll gain a buff called Empowered, which increases the damage and recharge rate of your abilities. This is great on its own, but it gets even better when you pair it with the Strand subclass. As you may know, the Strand subclass is all about using your three melee abilities. With the Heart of Inmost Light, you can make those abilities even more deadly. Imagine throwing a Thermite Grenade that not only sets enemies on fire, but also deals even more damage thanks to the Empowered buff. To really make the most of the Heart of Inmost Light, you'll want to focus on building up your Discipline and Strength stats. Discipline will reduce the cooldown of your grenades, while Strength will reduce the cooldown of your melee. Pair this with mods that boost Strand ability damage or enhance the effects of the Empowered buff, and you'll be an unstoppable force of Strand destruction. Overall, the Heart of Inmost Light is a fantastic exotic for Titans who love to use their abilities with a good balance of gunplay. With its ability to empower your abilities, it's a must-have for any Strand subclass build. Enough of Inmost Light, and let's move on to the next exotic on our list, the Armamentarium. This chess piece is a fan favorite among Titans and for good reason. It's an excellent all-around exotic that's versatile enough to be used in a variety of situations. The Armamentarium provides you with an additional grenade charge which can come in handy in both PvE and PvP. But the Armamentarium is going to be even more devastating in Strand as you will get three options for grenades in Strand's subclass. Strand will see three new grenades including Grapple which is controlled with a grenade button. The Threadling Grenade splits into three projectiles that weave into Threadlings upon impact. The Shackle Grenade effectively acts as a bola detonating in a suspending blast and sending out smaller secondary bolas to suspend nearby enemies. In summary, Armamentarium is an excellent exotic for any Titan looking to deal damage control zones or shut down enemy abilities. It's versatile enough to be used in a variety of situations, and when paired with the Strand subclass, it can be incredibly effective. Now, let's take a look at the third exotic armor piece for Titans, the Crest of Alpha Lupi. This chest armor not only looks badass, but it also has some amazing perks that make it a must-have for any Titan out there. When you place a barricade with the Crest of Alpha Lupi equipped, it generates a healing pulse that instantly heals both you and your allies within 12 meters. The amount healed can vary depending on the situation, with the healing pulse restoring either 58 health or up to 130 health. It will always heal for whichever value restores the most health. However, it's worth noting that the Healing Pulse requires Line of Sight to allies, so make sure you position yourself accordingly. But that's not all. The Crest of Alpha Lupi also has another benefit that synergizes well with the new Strand subclass. When you use a super ability while wearing the Crest of Alpha Lupi, you'll generate an extra orb of power. This can be especially useful in activities where generating orbs is crucial, such as raids or nightfall strikes. But how does it synergize with the Strand subclass specifically? While the Strand subclass has an aspect called Drenger's Lash, which causes a wave of Strand to rush forward from your barricade when you use your class ability. This wave suspends and disables any enemies caught in its path, making them easy pickings for you and your allies. By using the Crest of Alpha Lupi, you can not only provide healing for yourself and your allies, but also generate extra orbs of power to help you and your team during a super. Overall, the Crest of Alpha Lupi is an excellent exotic for Titans who want to be a reliable support player for their team while also generating extra orbs of power to aid in the fight. Not to mention, this allows Titans to have the right balance between defense and offense. Let's move on to the fourth exotic on our list, the Mask of the Quiet One. This exotic helmet is a favorite among Titans who love to get up close and personal with their enemies. Its unique perk, Dreaded Visage, has some interesting benefits that can help you stay alive in the heat of battle. 
First off, the Mask of the Quiet One will heal you to 70 health on a critical kill, which is a pretty handy way to keep yourself alive. But that's not all. This exotic also generates 5% class, grenade, and melee energy every time you take damage. That means you can charge up your abilities faster, allowing you to use them more often in combat. Now, how does this exotic synergize with the new Strand subclass? Well, since Strand Titans are all about getting close and personal with their enemies, they're likely to take a lot of damage in the process. With the Mask of the Quiet One equipped, that damage can actually be beneficial, as it will charge up your abilities faster. Of course, you'll want to be careful not to take too much damage, as there is a one-second cooldown between activations. But if you play your cards right, the Mask of the Quiet One can be a powerful tool in your arsenal. So, if you're a Titan who likes to live dangerously, give this exotic a try and see how it works for you. Moving on to the fifth exotic for Titans, we have Synthosubs. With the Strand subclass putting more emphasis on melee abilities, this exotic can shine even more in Lightfall. It provides an extra lunge range passively and more melee damage while the player is surrounded by three or more enemies, making your melee attacks even more deadly. When surrounded by three or more enemies, it activates biotic enhancements, which increase melee lunge range and improve melee and super damage. This effect lasts for 8 seconds and provides a 50% increase in super damage, a 200% increase in PvE melee damage, and a 100% increase in PvP melee damage. With this exotic, players can also enjoy an increased melee lunge range of up to 7 meters, making it easier to close the gap and unleash deadly melee attacks on enemies. Alternatively, players can also opt for Wormbound's Caress if they want to stack damage by getting melee kills without worrying about how many enemies are around. As mentioned before, Strand will see three new grenades including Grapple, which is controlled with the grenade button. The Threadling grenade splits into three projectiles that weave into Threadlings upon impact. The Shackle grenade effectively acts as a bola, detonating in a suspending blast and sending out smaller secondary bolas to suspend nearby enemies. And there you have it the top exotic armor pieces for Titans in the new Strand subclass in Destiny 2's Lightfall expansion. These exotics are all powerful tools that can help you create a build that's focused on dealing massive amounts of damage controlling zones, supporting your team, or staying alive in the heat of battle. Whether you choose the Heart of Inmost Light to empower your abilities, the Armamentarium to have extra grenades, the Crest of Alpha Lupi to provide healing and generate extra orbs of power, the Mask of the Quiet One to charge up your abilities faster, or Synthosubs to make your melee attacks deadlier, you can't go wrong with any of these exotics. Thank you for watching, if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please don't forget to like the video, leave a comment below, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting builds and gaming content. Have a great rest of your week.